all right what's good you guys we're back with another video and today i'm gonna be showing y'all how to get hotspots after patch six so i'm not gonna waste too much time we're just gonna get right into it so the first thing you want to do is go to your my player minutes and then you want to go to your name and make sure that you have the flame emo emoji next to your name now that will make sure that when you simulate the games over the season that you're not getting any cold spots and they'll give you nothing but uh hot spots everywhere because the game will register your player as as hot and he'll be like on a streak so after that this is the longest part of the process and you just gonna have to go ahead and simulate every game now if you're like me and this is my second player you probably haven't played that much in my career because number one it's boring and number two they made it to where you can grind out badges everywhere else so it's not a necessity to play here so for me since my i have a couple other friends that are like one's a 90 already or above a 90 and then i have one that's pretty close you know th those guys kind of like carried this player that i was playing with until he got really good on the park so i rarely never really played that much in my career on this player so anyways once you're almost done with this part and you know you're almost at the end you just want to go all the way down and then simulate into the playoffs okay and also one last thing no don't try to play any all-star games or anything like that just go ahead and sim all the way through but after that you want to sim through the regular season then once you get to this screen you want to just hit dismiss after that you want to go to your first playoff game and then you want to just play the game choose a jersey and then go right into it now i'm going to skip this part and once you get in the game you just want to simulate to the end of it and then after that go to your my court and then you can see you just run around and look at the the dots on your player i have hot spots everywhere now if you paid attention in the beginning i had zero hot spots on this player at on any point in the court and the paint around the edges any of that stuff now the shot chart shot like or showed how well i shot during the season in certain places but those were not hot spots okay you have to pay attention to that now after that you can actually just go right back to the minutes and just check your your stuff again and then i'll show you guys the difference right now scroll down and then here you go you can see i have it everywhere it's almost except for like the the inside floater area or area that you know i can get later on by just doing teardrops in pro-am or anything else but um that's it for this video and uh, i'll catch you guys later peace